Uh, good morning, everybody. My name is uh, Ikpen Sylvester, and uh, I'm the current chairman of Urumi Like Minds Initiative. Um, it's a Litu association that we formed a couple of years ago, and all we do is reach out to homes like this and pull together to develop Urumi as our, our own community. Uh, if you drive around Rumi, for example, you see street names written on almost every street in Rumi. Those brilliant, uh, reflective, uh, green street names. We did that. You see our names there. And we've done so many projects in Rumi. In fact, only yesterday, we just signed a contract for the renovation of Rumi Library. And so many more that we're doing. So this is just one of the many things that we do. And we, we are hoping to be able to do so much more in the years to come. So Rumi Like Minds came into being early 2020. So we are just a little over two years old. Uh, we are duly registered with the CAC, so we have a name that is registered and uh, which we operate with. And like you asked, the striking force, what really motivates us is our love of love for motherland and our love for, for the for, for society, for our people. And that is why, like I told the sisters just now, what we try to do is do good to those who cannot repay us. In, my, in our own opinion, when you do good to people who can pay you back, that is like it's like a loan you are giving somebody a loan because you want to get money back but here like we just mentioned that most of us don't stay in Romi. but you heard now that we are just about uh, renovating Romi library not for our children but for the children of people who will be here who will grow here who we at least uh, to help so that's been our force and uh, again another force that helps with what we do is the numbers we have we have people across the world who are connected to Romi. Some are not even Urumi indigents. Like my our vice chairman is an Igbo guy. He grew up here. He, he lived here. So we are connected. So that number is what helps us. We put together even little little trickles, but at the end of the day, we get so much done. Uh, we have quite a lot to do this year, and um, and we thank God. We are praying God for enablement so that we're able to pull through. Um, the first these are the first of projects that we are doing this year. Like I said, this visit to homes as well as the library upgrade. But we have so much. You know, we are supporting the Rumi Vigilante. The Reform Rumi Vigilante has been adopted by us. as uh, we, we give them telephones with which they communicate with each other. They don't have to pay to call each other. All those guys you see around, at least securing our, our, our society, our, our Rumi. So we pay for that for them. We have a plan this year to even give them um, equipment, vehicular equipment to support their operations. You know, we also have the football tournament. I'm sure you heard about it last 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 year, sometime last year. We had uh, an all secondary school football tournament that uh, I think Budi Budi won the maiden edition. So that will happen again this year. We give scholarship to students in uh, Urumi Technical College and uh, the NICT, the one at Old Nova. We give them annual scholarships. All that will happen this year. And many more. So we have a loaded year. In fact, this year will be our biggest year so far, by the grace of God. Am 
Sister Victoria, uh, I'm very sister young. of St. Louis. Ah. We are very grateful. We can't be thankful enough. It's that God keeps surprising us every year. And uh, at this festive period, um, people have really reached out to us. And we are very grateful to this group. This will go a long way in meeting our needs. The needs of our, of our residents. We call them residents, people who live here. And the people who also visit outside. We take some food to them. We, yeah, and this will sustain us for a long time. Ah, we have already prayed for them and we we'll continue to pray for them. We we'll pray for all our benefactors, all those who support us in various ways, either through cash or kind, in whatever way, that God will bless them and reward their efforts and bless their families too. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. Okay, I really want to say a very big thank you to everyone, to everyone who contributed to this uh, gesture. And may God replenish your pockets massively. Thank you very much. I really appreciate it. Yes. But it's almost seven months now. I see the one place. So, now do it for me. God bless you now. What do you have to tell uh, Urumi like minds uh, are in you know, for providing this? Uh, uh, um, just God will bless you now. It's not easy. So, God will give add more give now more power so to do more again so god bless you speak a few so that i make some quotation i think it's necessary sorry sir Okay, 
Thank you for giving us the resources, the strength and the ability to be able to give to someone else. Oh Lord, I pray for them that it will not be their last. But that they continue to do this, not just to do so, but several other persons in our society. As it is, oh Lord, encourage them and their families. Bless them and protect them. Give them that which money cannot buy. That always they will count your blessings on their lips. Give them reasons to come to you for thanksgiving. That together as a family and as a group, you realize their goal and their aims. Make a prayer to press Amen. Amen. Jesus Christ, we you to leave you. Behind you to guard you. We need to keep you. I used to sustain you. We need to bless you. May you bless all of you today. Thank you. I don't know if you heard that I was lectured that.